Well, there has been some new uh, KCD news for another video on their channel, which I want to have a look at and react to uh, on this channel as well. So let's have a look and see what's going on here. This is the making of announcement trailer. Let's have a look. So, hi, my name is Petr Pekas and I'm cinematic director at Warhorse Studios. Nice. And I prepared for you a small sneak peek behind the scenes of how cinematics for KCD2 were made. He's gone. Okay. Story of KCD2 is epic and complex, but in the same time realistic and down to earth. So basically, our main goal was to create cutscenes that will be telling this story in the same manner. The action scenes were choreographed with stuntmen that have deep knowledge about medieval warfare. Not only fencing and shooting firearms, Damn. but also medieval it. battlefields were organized. Every bit of the battlefield was recorded and directed separately, while still maintaining the mood, the pacing and overall timing of the scene to create this illusion of Wait grand, a crowded assault. Wait a second. was recorded and directed separately while still maintaining the mood, the pacing and overall timing of the Is this like... Is this Goldeneye on N64? Is that how they made it? That's all it looks like. <laughs> scene ...to create this illusion of grand crowd nice. assault. We really wanted the scenes to feel authentic and... I'm sure it'll look better than that when it's finished, guys. ...but also militarily oh. organised. So you can... Trebuchet! Most Accurate depiction of medieval battlefield as we could do. Oh, look at Tom screaming into One the camera. Of nice. Our main focus is in cinematics is uh, the atmosphere because KCD2 mm. is darker and more mature and complex. So we really stepped up with cinematic lighting, the weather effects and composition, but also with our sound effects and atmospheres. We really want you as a player to feel present in this realistic medieval environment. Oh boy, cannot wait. Performance capture was a great addition to our new project. We built our own custom-made head-mounted camera rigs wow. that helped us to capture performances of guys like Tom McKay and Luke Dale and other incredibly talented actors. So we tried really hard Man, can to you capture imagine wearing the all that stuff? of their talent and recreate it as precise as possible. And of course, we are capturing lots of horses. Uh, well, horse riders on chairs. <laughs> uh, the thing nice. with horses is that they don't fit to elevator much. They shit they everywhere. Have tendency to uh, poop a lot. So yeah. Yeah. At this point, twelve professional filmmakers and three sound designers are working full time just on cinematics to deliver what I believe will be one of the most cinematic experience you ever witness in an uh, open world game. I will just say I hope you will enjoy it. Keep your eye on updates and more videos like this one and cheers. Amen. Short but sweet. Nice. Yeah, so they um they've definitely put a lot more money behind this one, hey? So all the motion capture. Yeah, that would not be a comfy setup. Wearing those things. Um in front of all your friends. God. If I wore one of those, I'd be giving the kids nightmares, that's for sure. Okay, yeah. No, it looks good. So they're going all out with their motion capture and their cinematography. That's great. Just another reason to get excited for what's to come. So, yeah, all looks good so far. I'm just going to keep lapping up every bit of news these guys drop um, until they release. So, awesome. Anyway.